All right, guys, we're going to talk about inflection today, tonality. Now, I realize if you're thinking right now, and you know, that's just really mundane stuff, but the mastery level, the black belt skill level here is in a slight, subtle touch that makes all the difference in the world. And it's at the end of a statement that you really want to land well, where it inflects up, almost as if it was a question. That makes sure that something that's really important that you have to land is gonna land without causing them to get their guard up. I'll give you an example. We're in a training session and we're telling people that labeling a negative in advance doesn't plant a negative. Now this scares a lot of people. So we tell them about it theoretically and they say, okay, you know, it kinda goes sort of past them. But then when we talk about actually doing it, it scares them. So we go through it, we say, all right, we want you to label these negatives in advance. They go, oh, no, 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 I can't do that. That'll, that'll plan a negative. Now, we told them earlier that it doesn't, and I've got to remind them of that, but gently. Now, I could say, so when we told you earlier that labeling a negative in advance doesn't plant it, you thought we were wrong. Now, my tone of voice inflecting down is kind of harsh, and there's a pretty good chance that saying it like that may cause it to land hard and cause their guard to be up. And I don't need the guard to be up. So instead, I need to say it. So when we told you before that labeling a negative in advance doesn't plant the negative, you thought we were wrong? Now saying it like that the second time makes sure it lands. I could say you thought I was wrong, as if I think you're wrong. Or can say, you thought I was wrong? As if I'm genuinely questioning. I said it the second way, and the person we were teaching said, oh, no, I guess not. And that's exactly the way I needed it to land. So tonality at the end ensures that what you have to have land will land the way you want it to so that they think about it it triggers the thought pattern that you want it to think, and it doesn't cause their guard to come up. Inflecting up at the end is a master negotiator move and mastery of tonality.